welcome to your collective reading. This reading is a timeless reading for those who need to hear the message. It's for you all, so it doesn't matter what star sign you are. So this is for all of you. All signs, see if this helps. We've got the Justice card in reverse coming out first. The Nine of Pentacles is reversed. So your person... Okay, there's an energy of something being very restricted for some reason. Yeah, and this could be communication for a lot of you. I, some of you waiting for communication or a message to come in. It feels like um, you're getting... The energy I'm getting is it could be a communication problem, yeah? It's like um, you're waiting for that and the frustration is growing. So I think maybe I'm picking up, I'm going to say I'm picking up on maybe you getting really annoyed right now. I'm very annoyed. Um, your person, maybe person in question also might be trapped. There's also, ah, it's not just messages. It's an actual issue of seeing each other possibly as well. There could be a travel problem. So I don't know if there is a distance, a long distance or some kind of distance travel wise between you. But until uh, the feeling, overwhelming feeling I'm getting cycle is until this message comes in or until this happens, it seems to be a pause or a stop. Uh, almost, I nearly said full stop, <laughs> but um, it's like something can't proceed unless something happens first. Your justice card is reverse. Somebody is like, um, if you don't, I don't know whether it's your energy picking up. It's like if there is no um, action, there isn't like nothing coming for you. It's like you're not going to do anything about it because you need to see some action here. There could be a problem with someone, someone's jealousy as well with your nine of pentacles. But there could be a lot of stuff. Somebody actually may be a workaholic, like they're working, work, work, and that's what they're concentrating on. Um, I'm doing this few scenarios because this is a collective reading, guys. This could be a financial setback. There's jealousy now, maybe, or insecurity now gathering. Maybe for you. I feel it's more your for you. I don't know why. Um, your person is on a go slow, I feel. They're slow with contact. It's frustrating the hell out of you. Yeah, that's what they're doing. I feel like this person's been making new promises and they haven't kept them. So uh, you've got a king of cups in reverse who think they can charm you in the upright position. But when it becomes in reverse, they become emotionally distant um, or they become emotionally uh, abusive, should we say, where they might tell you what you want to hear when it suits them. So... And that's why your justice card has come up first, because in reverse justice is telling you that some unfair treatment is happening right now. And it's like it's not fair with what's going on to you. I feel like there's a, been a lot of investment from you to this person and you're not getting what you're owed back, you know, um, definitely. So they're on a go slow. They may be making excuses as well. Um, if they may be saying that they're, you know, their hands are tied. They can't do anything about the situation. They've got to work. They've got family commitments. They've got to do this. And I think that there's a huge, now there's become a problem. I think that I'm getting that feeling for a lot of you that you're about to lose your temper or you're about to get really angry and send some kind of really horrid message, which may be, um, have a knock on effect in future communication as well. Let me see what else I can tell you. It's like this person's not either emotionally available or they're very distant or they're not giving you that king of cups, like not understanding. This guy is empathetic and understanding in the upright. So when he's in reverse, he now becomes unreasonable and doesn't really get it. So he's made, this person might not even know what the hell you're, where you're coming from, you know? Uh, we've got soulmate vibes, soul connection, partnership agreement, soul contract. Let's have a look what else, though. Okay. It's like when they're around, it's great. And then all of a sudden they do this. Ah, <laughs> the runner. 
runner in a codependent relationship, fear of intimacy and listening to ego. You know, with a king, it could be that they're egocentric, like they want to do what they want to do. Some of them might not be ready for something as well. Fear of intimacy, fear of being in a co... Um, excuse me. It's like fear of commitment is what I'm seeing here quite a bit. Yeah, that feels like that to me. Um, let's have a look what else I can tell you. Okay. We have deception and it says someone is wearing a false self mask in this relationship. So they're not, okay, I feel it's more to do with the bottom bit. Someone is wearing a false self mask. In the, so this person is not showing their emotional side to you, even though that sometimes I think that they, they do. So that energy of when they're about, they talk you around to make you believe that they're that they're, they're, they're the king of cups upright, so they are into it and stuff. But what I'm seeing is an energetic energy of not being progressive and communication is horrific, I think, at times as well. Um, yeah, I feel like there's excuses being made by your person. It's like there always there's always a problem with them. You know, there's, there's something wrong all the time. Yeah, the deception card has come out. Let's see what else I can tell you here. I think I'll pull three from here. I'm aware not all of it will resonate, but just let's see what jumps out. See which one is resonating for you. Don't let it fit your situation. If it's there, it's there. Intuition and inner knowing. So these cards are for you. Intuition and inner knowing. Maybe you do have that feeling that something isn't right and you can't put your finger on it, but... You know, they're keeping their emotional cards. We've got single parent and responsibilities, and there's a child there, baby. And we've got family and security. I'm wondering whether for some of you this is the issue. They may they may have another family or they may have kids, or maybe they've got exes with kids that they have to sort. I feel that could be a huge problem and it could be interfering in your connection. For some, it won't be for all. Just take what is ever... I'm letting spirit sort of guide us today to see where this is going. Again, with these cards, this will be advice for you. I will pull, pull three out. Please take the advice that is resonating with your situation, okay? Because when you see it, you'll know it, you know? Okay. I'll shuffle a bit more, actually. Three, okay? First one. Spirit just pulled that card out. We have the card of forgiveness. Stop focusing your energy on past events for life is too precious to waste. You create your reality by what you think, dream and imagine. Let me know if any of this resonates for you, my loves, okay? I'm here to help. Here's the next one. Okay, that's the moon. <laughs> surrender. At times, we must surrender the old before something new can enter our lives. Let go and all will work out. If all three resonate, that's fine as well. Pull one from the middle, okay? If you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind, for the heart is the gateway to the soul. So if you could do anything, what would it be? The answer dwells in your heart, not in your mind, for the heart is the gateway to the soul. It's weird because, if you notice with the pictures, apart from that one, these two are pretty similar. Both sleeping. When I'm looking at these cards, I'm wondering if that's what some of you need to do. <laughs> don't know why it's like do you need to sleep like you're not resting or you can't sleep at night for worrying 
Oh, that's a that's a horrible feeling when someone can't uh, is awake most of the night. So, take whatever's resonating with you guys. This is an all signs reading, so it's not going to be for everyone. Pick cards are coming, okay? So they haven't gone anywhere. I've got tons on there as well to help you. Go and pick your um, pile of cards. See if it resonates with your situation. See what spirit has to tell you. I'll be back with a new pick a card really soon. So don't worry, they haven't gone anywhere. So I hope this reading helps you today. Um, please be so kind to give the video a thumbs up, drop a comment, subscribe if you're new here. Um, yes, <laughs> thank you so much. Um, yeah, take care guys. Take care till next time. Bye-bye.